At the end of the 20th century, a new type of frigate would revolutionize the naval world, the Lafayette-class frigates. Navies were able to move forward, benefiting from surface combatants that were ever more reliable, effective, and automized. 20 years later, Frem multi-mission frigates perfectly embody this combination of tradition and modernity. At the end of the 90s, France renewed its surface fleet to reinforce the French Navy's operational capacities. Its industrial partner, DCNS, faced a major technological challenge, conceiving a new class of combat vessel, the first military vessel to benefit from computer-assisted design programs. Aiming for the highest resistance to stress and attack, DCNS launched extensive trials, testing new material standards, introducing composite elements, running impact and assault tests on the vessels and their critical equipment. But the most remarkable technological innovation is stealth and the reduction of the radar signature, making Lafayette-class frigates state-of-the-art warships. With the success of the Lafayette-class frigates, DCNS was ranked among the top international defense suppliers and designed an export version of Lafayette. With such large programs, DCNS definitively validated the modular construction method applied to warship building, enabling simultaneous construction on several sites and considerably reducing manufacturing times. In response to customers' requirements, a number of technological improvements were introduced, such as the development of an anti-submarine version. The Sawari II program for the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia benefited from all these innovations, as well as developments in 3D computer model technology. This technical 3D revolution introduced automatic pre-construction control procedures and reduced costs and production times. Finally, a new weapon was integrated, the Asta missile system, for which DCNS designed the Silver it would become the reference in vertical launch systems for frigates. In early 2000, DCNS broke new ground yet again. The program for the Singapore Navy was remarkable in terms of crew optimization and ambitious technology transfers. DCNS team successfully met this challenge and worked on an even more effective vessel. They adapted civilian technology to the constraints of a military vessel, reconsidering every element to optimize each function and the full range of equipment. The level of automization in vessel control translates in no more than three operators required on the bridge. Crew levels would be reduced by 40% compared to the Lafayette class. The combat system was enhanced with a new Thales Heracles multifunction radar and Aster missiles, giving the frigates first-class anti-aircraft capacities. The ambitious technology transfer program with ST Marine from Singapore was a success. Out of six new frigates, Five were built in Singapore with the support from DCS teams.